Sharing your knowledge and selling courses online is one of the fastest growing business models in 2021. Whether you're a consultant or teacher looking to expand your current business, or if you're just interested in getting started in selling online courses. Hey creators, I'm Josh, content creator here at Forento. At Forento, we're on a mission to empower educators, coaches, and entrepreneurs, and help them create, run, and scale their online businesses. If you want to learn about the product we're building, or get more tips and tricks on how to run your online course business, hop on over to our website and sign up for free. No matter what topic that you're looking to teach, these five steps that I'm going to walk you through are crucial to effectively creating and launching your course. Find your course topic. When getting started, there are three essential questions that you need to know the answer to. What is your course topic? Who are your target customers? What motivates your target customers to purchase your course? But don't worry if you don't know the answers to all these questions yet, there are several ways to move forward. When deciding on a topic, you can either choose one of your liking, maybe something related to your previous work, maybe something that you learnt while travelling. Whatever it may be, make sure it's something that you have a genuine interest in and that you can talk about for hours without getting bored. If you don't have a specific topic in mind, a great way to establish one is to first decide on a target audience and interview them in order to understand what needs they have and find a topic through their everyday struggles. When specifying your target customers, make sure to include what motivates them to learn your specific topic for how long they have wanted to learn about it, and from where they are currently hearing about or reading about the topic. Having this information when marketing your course to customers is critical. We've created a presentation with a template for creating persona cards with more detailed guidelines on how to specify them. Grab it for free in the description below. Find out where your customers hang out. When you have answered these three questions with your personas in mind, try finding where your target audience hangs out. Use your imagination and search for all types of niche forums, sites, social media groups, or influencers. When you've found a couple of people or businesses matching your personas, or even better, if you know any before spending hours trying to find where they hang out, talk to them. It won't hurt. Try to listen and understand what their needs are. It will be seriously valuable later on when you start creating your first course content. And also try and see if there are any possible ways for you to build organic traffic and relationships with potential customers as early on as possible. Acquiring your first couple of students and customers is always the hardest part. And it's a great way to gather feedback and input on your course material before you spend any money on advertising or promotion. Find your unique insight or differentiator. Choose and focus on one single niche and aim to build a truly valuable course material for a number of customers. Build a loyal customer base first and scale your content when you're up and running and hopefully profitable. A great way to build a scalable business is to first do things that don't scale in order to get your first customers. And from there, you can develop your strategies and scale as fast as you want. Write great content. Choose your course format. Are your target customers visual learners or people who'd rather read and get quizzed on their newly consumed content? If you don't know, this is a great question to ask one of your target customers while interviewing them about their needs. Outline main points. A great way to start creating your content in an effective way is to decide early on what exact topics your course will cover, even if you find yourself having to make changes or add on new content later on. After outlining your content, you can further detail your plan by adding specific questions your content will touch through the different segments or chapters of your course. Create your first piece of content. This is probably the most important part of your course material. Not only is it the first point of contact with your newly committed customer, but also a great clip to display to non-paying customers in order to inform them about the course and its content. Creating course material can take everything from a couple of hours to several months, depending on what type of material that you're looking to produce. But our four key rules for creating any type of compelling course content are the following. Make it clear why your learners need to learn about your topics. Try to understand what value does the course provide them, and what your students will be able to do with their new knowledge after taking your course. 
share your course content pre-launch. Don't hesitate to share your content before committing it to your course. Have family members, friends, or people within your market come with their feedback and input. Split your content into easily explained and understood chunks. It is okay to get rid of content in order to maintain a flow throughout your courses. In a lot of cases, one course can be split into several smaller courses and the other way round. So make sure that your content fits your customers through both format and length. Repeat key needs as often as possible. Make sure the key needs you identified during either your research, your own experience, or through customer interviews are repeated as often as possible. A great way to make sure your customers are consuming your content and learning effectively is quizzing them interactively. So, to conclude, how you create your online course in 48 hours follows find your target audience and make sure to connect with them and find ways to interact and engage with them through various channels. Find your unique insight or differentiator. Make sure there is something special about your course and that it satisfies your target audience. Write great content. Make it clear why your learners should take your course. Repeat the key points of your course topic as often as possible. Hey, thanks for watching. See you next time. I'm out.